Nellie was just born. Not sure what happened to mom. I just kept trying to figure out what the heck to do because she needed a little buddy. All my fawns were bigger, older, and I was going to be releasing those. That's what I brought Polly in. <laughs> Polly was five weeks old. Nellie immediately started licking Polly so aggressively at first that I thought I had to separate them. I thought, well, if it's hurting her, she would jump away, but she didn't. She kept following Nelly. Then they both laid down in the corner together. I thought, well, that's a new friendship. <laughs> Nelly was the mother for Polly in the beginning. Even though she was only a couple weeks old, it's like she knew this little fragile baby needed something. Eating your food. I was trying to get Nellie to eat grain for the first time, and she just wasn't having it. Polly came over and just started eating it, and that got her to eat it. She jumped more than she ran. It could just have been her personality. <laughs> or it could have been watching a little bunny jumping everywhere. I don't know. When Nellie would get going a little too crazy, running and jumping and playing. Go get some water, silly. Look at Polly. What's Polly doing? Polly would just kind of find a little corner and just stare at her like she was crazy. Stay safe, Polly. Every time I would check on them, they were cuddled in a corner together. What are you two doing? There were these times where I would look in the stall and I thought Polly got out. There she is. And then I realized she was underneath Nellie. Me too. Nellie was always very hesitant and aware that Polly was under her. Watch your battle. She was always so cautious. I wanted her to get used to outside and used to not being with Polly. She's outside with Tinkerbell and Buddy. So those three are going to be my little herd for the winter and I'll release them in the spring. They're teaching her the same affection that she gave Polly. Polly is definitely going to be staying with me forever. I'm hoping Polly will remember all of this and when I get that first fawn in the spring, Polly's going to know what to do again. It does make me feel really good knowing what you hoped would work, worked. <laughs> I'm glad I got to experience it.